Okay, Jacques Derrida in one minute. So Derrida is this French philosopher guy and part-time floozy who gave scholars something to do for a while until they got done proving that anything anybody ever thought was completely wrong. Before Derrida, there was this thing structuralism, which was all the rage and all about fitting authorial intention and meaning into a nice little box. Derrida said, fuck no, you can't know what the author meant because it's just words and words are full of contradiction, like for example, pharmacon, the Greek word for both cure and poison. Hence, Derrida comes up with the idea of difference, which says meaning is an endless chain of deferment, kind of like student loans. In other words, the philosophy of deconstructionism says meaning depends on the materials used to express it, and the materials are always already contradictory. You can't have a building without beams, a shirt without seams, colonizer without colonized, black without white, good without bad. But as any good deconstructionist will tell you, it's not about identifying the binaries, it's about what's in between, the difference. Derrida also said Western thought is phallogocentric, privileging the penis over the pussy and the page over the page. Yeah, no shit. Oh, and here's a 15 second deconstructive literary analysis of Lord of the Rings. Structuralist. The Lord of the Rings is a story of creating a ring of warriors, a fellowship, to destroy a ring of power. Deconstructionist. Fuck no, it's about destroying something that's destructive, which is creative, but it's also destructive because once Sauron's ring goes bye-bye, the fellowship of the ring also goes bye-bye. Aren't I creative? Actually, I'm deconstructive.